Hey guys, it's me, Drew. Welcome back to my channel. As you see from the title above, this is going to be a Scentsy Christmas haul. Now, I have the tiniest bit of wax I've ever had, but I have eight warmers to share for you. So I closed out a party and I was like, I just love these warmers. This is the first year that I'm in my fully furnished apartment. Last year, I did not have a dining room table. I didn't have all the shelving that I really wanted. And there's just like one or two things that I still want to add. But for now, I have places that I can put so many warmers. And I have a good bit of Christmas warmers, but not nearly as many as I want. And during this Christmas collection or this holiday collection and the warmer of the month for November, there was so much to be had. But before we dive into the warmers, let's do the wax because it's very small and then I can make room for the warmers. So without further ado, let's get into it. All right, so I did two six packs. I did a six, pla six pack of regular bars and a six pack of licensed bars. So we'll start with the six regular bars. I picked up three scents from the holiday collection that I just wanted more of. So the first one we have here is Rum Pum Plum, and I have two bars here. This is like the more deep, dark, and rich sweet plum pastry. This bar actually smells more like sweet plum pastry than my original bar. It's just a rich plum pastry scent with an extra pie crust. Like, I feel like sweet plum pastry is lacking the pie crust, but it is so good still, where this has that delicious rich pie crust. So picked up two bars of that. Picked up two bars of cranberry candy cane. I love this. After seeing a lot of reviews saying it smelled like a nail salon, I was nervous. It's beautiful. If you like cranberry scents and candy cane scents, totally up your alley. I don't love plain peppermint. They need to be mixed with something. And the cranberry is so tart and rich here. This is like ultimate Christmas for me. Like instead of Christmas tree, I love a good like cranberry candy cane scent. And then I picked up two vanilla barnwood. This scent, you guys, is so yummy. If you like Pacific sandalwood, kicked up a notch, definitely try this. And I do get that like light fruity pebbles note at the end. I have not melted these yet. I actually have a really interesting empties video because there's some scents that I actually had to take out of the warmers because I was like, this is not for me. So definitely been changing my wax more, but this smells so good. Oh my gosh, I love. So that was it for the six pack of wax. And then I did six. Yeah, six frightfully delightful. If you saw my initial first sniffs of this, license bars don't really do much for me. I mean, one, you have to pay an extra 50 cents and I don't ever find them special enough. This, however, is so good. It reminds me of the candle company, Gold Canyon, which is there. I don't know what's going on with them because they went out of business a couple years ago and now they're like rebranded. But anytime you ask the company if they're the old Gold Canyon, like they totally blow past the question. So really weird and sneaky. I did buy one on their official Amazon and it was terrible. It was their fresh orange, which I used to love. And it smelled like burning plastic when I burned it. So I returned it. So they're not the same Gold Canyon candles like they used to, but Gold Canyon had a fragrance called Peaches and Pumpkins that I always found to be super interesting. And this smells just like it. It is so good. It's going in my club. And these six with the two that I have now will take me through the fall season. And I added two to my club. That way I always get the bars. All right, let's dive into the warmer, shall we? Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull one, show you, and then pause the video and unbox because it can take a lot of extra time unboxing these warmers and re and like displaying them. So I'm just going to show you, unbox them, and then hop back on the camera. So the first one we have here is Snow Cute. So excited. Actually, I'm just gonna show the boxes first and then I will unbox them all at once. We have Snowed In. 
I basically got all the warmers that were like not religious. <gasps> this guy, this is the Sparkling Snowman. I did not get him last year. He was a warmer of the month last year. I just never got him. So I was really excited to pick that up. Now, the Enchanted Pumpkins from the fall, I have two and they flank my TV in the living room and they're beautiful. So I wanted to change them out and I thought the fabulous flurry warmer would be perfect for that. So I'm only gonna obviously unbox one of these, but I picked up two of those to flank my TV. And then I picked up this guy because he's just so cute, retro reindeer. He doesn't really go with my decor, sorry. Um, but I think he'll be cute in my bathroom. And then I picked up two minis. I got Snow Cute, so the matching mini, and uh, Glistening or Glittering Greetings mini. So really excited for those. So within instantly for you guys, these will all be unboxed and we will share them. And I'm back. Wow, that was a lot. Um, the way that my setup is, I'm literally using all the plugs for lights and filming and such. So I don't have a capability to plug them in here, but I will plug each one in and film a little snippet video of them plugged in on my counter and stuff. So I will be able to show you what they look like. But first impressions, they're beautiful. So we're gonna start with the Snow Cute Warmer. All right, for one, if you don't like glitter, this is not the warmer for you. This looks like a little Christmas village. You have your snowman, your trees, your wreath, the little lamp post, and you have your little rectangle dish here. If you're familiar with the haunted house from I think it was a couple years ago, it's that same dish there. It does have a number four, and then you have the roof, and it actually has a big cutout on the back for the scent. And then it just sits there. How cute is he? And fully 100%, it's a 25 watt warmer. So whenever you put this in, the windows will glow. It's so pretty. And because of that clear dish, that top window, it seems like will glow too. So this is beautiful. And all of these warmers I'm gonna show you are still available on my website. I'm going to set this up in my living room with the, um, from 2020, November of 2020, it was like a um, Christmas barn, super pretty. So I don't have the gingerbread house from a few years ago. I don't know why I didn't buy that, but I don't have that. So I'm going to definitely have to find that because that's so cute. <gasps> Speaking of so cute, you guys, for one, he's super petite, but we have the little reindeer, the retro reindeer. So he has his little scarf and his little hat and it is ceramic, but it is textured. So you can feel all the textures on there. And this is an element warmer. There is no removable dish, but it's a pretty deep dish. So I would still probably only do like two cubes in here, but this is gonna be perfect for my bathroom. If you can see all the texture there, so pretty. I love this warmer so much. His little ears, the antlers, super cute and petite. Definitely gonna go in my bathroom. And now this is not a new warmer, but it is returning. We have the sparkling snowman. Now his arms do come separate. So you do want to attach the arms and the whole entire body of the snowman actually glows with an LED light because this is an element warmer with a pretty big dish. So you put your wax, you have the little dish, you put your wax back here and then it'll emit the fragrance that way. So pretty. And he is, isn't this a big warmer? I think it's like 13 watts. So definitely a good powerhouse warmer here. And this is definitely good to leave out all winter long. Some of them are more Christmassy, but that's definitely one to leave out all winter long. And then, guys, look at Snowman. Oh my gosh. He is so big. And you can actually see the swirling in the blown glass. The details, these are his little eyes, his nose, his mouth. Now, 
the hat is that warmer that has the little notches. So make sure those notches are open so whenever you stick it in, like the jack-o'-lantern warmer, the hat doesn't fall off. So, but the hat has a nice big scent door opening so you'll be able to get great scent. But, oh, he is so cute. I love him. And then we have, let me see if I can hold them up at the same time. We have Mini Snowman. <gasps> okay, and now he's a mini plug-in. I don't want to break these. Look, look at how cute together. <gasps> oh my gosh, I can't stand it. All right, look at him. I'm going to take him off of the base. This is real life. All right, so the dish is not removable. However, the hat is. So you can stick the hat on there and it'll emit the scent, but look at how cute he is <gasps> with his little black and white scarf. And I love decorating with black and white for Christmas, so it's really cute. So excited for him. And then we have the Merry and Bright Warmer. This is one that really just spoke to me. It's going, oh, it's going in my bathroom. It is ceramic. Now, Elizabeth Quinn from Elizabeth Scenes and Scents has a great video of this plugged in. Um, the ceramic glows and those snowflakes illuminate and will definitely cast on the wall. It's so pretty. It has a nice big opening, actually, for a little plug-in. So really excited to, I'm going to put this one in my bathroom for the holidays. And then last but not least, we have the fabulous Flurry Warmer. Now, it's kind of hard to see on camera. This is one I'm definitely excited to light up. But... We have snowflakes of all different shapes and sizes all the way around. We have a big frosted dish, and then it has that like um, mercury glass aluminum sort of mirrored, it's mirrored finish inside there. So whenever this lights up, it is gonna glow. And it's actually sandblasted. It's a real rough texture, almost like a nail file on the outside. So I heard whenever it glows, and if you look, the snowflakes kind of look 3D. So whenever it glows, it's going to look like real life snowflakes. So really pretty. And I did get two of these, which are going to be beautiful in my living room for the holidays. So really exciting here. But I am going to insert some videos at the end. So I'm going to say thank you so much for watching. Let me know if you guys picked up any of these warmers. I know a few of my customers are getting their Christmas warmers in this week. Really exciting. I just love the holidays. It makes me so ready to decorate. But I am going to wait till Halloween. And then, boom, it's all Christmas in this house. So excited to decorate here. I already have some thoughts here. My dining room table. All the things are going to get changed to Christmas, so really excited for that. So don't forget to subscribe. Hit that notification bell. That way you're alerted every time I upload a video here on YouTube. I will leave my Scentsy Party link down below. Feel free to order if you don't have a consultant yet and pick up some of these warmers for yourself. Make it a better world, and I love you guys. Bye. Stay tuned for the end of the video.